Right folks, it's Monday the 16th of January 2023. See, I know my dates. I'm back at Kilpatrick House. Uh, I'm nearly at my camp spot. I was going to camp at Middle Duncombe, which is a wee hill, a very small hill. But because of the detour I've took and the lights fading, doesn't look like it with the sunshine in my face, but I've not got much light left. Uh, so I'm just going to camp at the same spot I camped the last time with Mark Silver Fox. I'm just going to camp there. So I'm just going to I'm just going to put on the footage of the detour I took. Never been up that way. That's a much nicer way. Uh, I think it's probably longer. As it that's. What I'm saying, I've lost uh, not get as much light as I thought I would have to go up the hill. So I'm just going to camp at the same spot as I've already said as the last time. So I'm not going to take any more footage until I get to the camp spot. So I'll just show you the detour, and then I'll be at the I'll be at the pitch spot. Scott's Wild Camper, the wild camping channel for the great outdoors.
this. There's my camp spot up there. Closed due to forestry work. Well, I'm just going to still camp there because I'm nowhere near the. I'm not going anywhere near the trees or the forest. I'm well away from it, so I'm going to camp up there and see what happens. If MD says anything, then I don't know. I'll just camp there somewhere. See now, it's getting late. I don't think there's. I don't think there's anyone about. Doesn't look like it, does it? So they can move me on at six o'clock in the morning when I'm up. So let's go. Let's get the tent sorted. I'm here. It's only it's a few weeks I was here. A month. I can't even remember. It wasn't that long ago I was here with Mark. There's the new trees. As you can see, I'm nowhere near the... I don't think it's the other doing the tree felling, I think it's further along, but I'm nowhere near the trees. Well away. Right folks, it's quarter past six. Uh, it's very cold. I don't know if it's minus four or minus seven. That's it. The forecast, but... The way the camera batteries are lasting five minutes. And it's more like, you know, minus seven. Anyway, I'm gonna get a hot drink. And ah, uh, Billy's coming up. He should be here maybe 30 minutes. He's no camping, he's just hiking up and then hiking back, back home. He'll be here for a while, a wee cup of tea, or whatever he's brought. I've not got any tea bags, so if he's wanting a cup of tea off me, he's had it. I've not got any tea bags. Right. I'll go and check if this is recording or the battery's died again. Well, there you go. There's a guest. <laughs> There's a guest, Billy. I just popped up with a muffin for Eddie. Right. Keen bearing gifts. <laughs> yeah. He's away. Oh, well, that's great. He's definitely away. Benderine tomorrow. Aye, I'm going to go do Benderine. Well, unless for some reason I don't get up. But my stuff's ready, so I don't want to waste another day because the day, the day was the, the, good, day, the, the day was good. Day. Well, all that I've done today is between Sunday and Monday, I'll folk will put down a nice wee trail, so it'll make it a wee bit easier. But yeah. no, Ben Dorian's a favourite hill of mine, so Aye. I'll uh, I'll, I'll scoot. I don't want to go too far, so Aye. I'll scoot. I'll sc well, hang on, you don't get very far for twenty quid in diesel these days, so uh, I'll just scoot up to Bridge Orkey and I'll I'll a wee scoot over the two main roads if, if I can do that. And I'll come back down the road. Right. So, and then my car goes in to get fixed on Thursday. So, good aye. stuff. Right, that's all you get, folks. Oh, well, nice to see you. <laughs> Happy New Year, everybody. I just after it, had a wee walk there with Billy. Well, I just walked him back up a wee bit. And I, I met him, I met him sort of, I had a wee 10 minute hike. You know, when he came here, I met him up. up up at the Humphrey bit, met him up there. So I got another wee, I don't know, 20, 20 minute hike done. So I'm just gonna batten down the hatches in a minute. Just a wee overnight, a bit of exercise, a bit of out time, just time, time to myself. This wasn't the original idea, I was hoping to get away with either Stevie or Mark for a couple of days, but it didn't work out. They had things that they didn't... Re <laughs> they had appointments that they'd forgot about and that sort of thing, so that's what happens, eh? That's, that's life. Can't they just, you know, be footloose and fancy free? Everybody's got uh, stuff to do and commitments. Right, I think I'll just say my good night. I'll take a wee bit of footage in the morning. 
So I'll see you. I'll see you in the morning. Good night. It's like an icicle in that tent. Not a breath of wind. Or very, very, very little wind. So the condensation's bad and everything's frozen. As you can see. Yeah. Still. I wasn't too bad in my gear, to be honest. It wasn't cold, it was okay. I get a phone signal here and it said uh, feels like minus nine. I think it was minus six air temperature. Feels like minus nine, so that's this morning. That was about an hour ago. I got a phone call for Stevie, boot and boots. And as you saw last night, uh, I got a visitor, Billy. Aye. It's always a thing I say when you think about it, it's, you go out in winter and you see it's very cold, do you know what I mean? <laughs> that's it, isn't it? That's, it? that's what it's about, the winter camping. Cold temperatures and the snow. That's the way I head up. Just uh, an easy path all the way though. I've got to be careful because <laughs> it could be, uh, could be a bit slippy. That's where they fell in the trees, I think. Maybe maybe further up, I don't know. That's Loch Humphrey. Loch Humphrey. I've camped over on that side a couple of times. Hammock and a and a tarp camp I did. Yeah, good stuff. That's where Billy walked in for you. Yeah, he came over. He came from that side and walked along there. I went up and met, uh, met him a wee bit. <laughs> I did a wee bit of walking. There's the sunrise. Right, folks, I think I might leave it there and I'll slowly get ready. See what I can do with the tent because it is it's ice and uh, Condensation, damp on the inside and ice on the outside, so I'll see how I get on packing it away. <laughs> so, just a wee overnighter. Hopefully, the next time I'm uh, further up north, uh, possibly with Sinclair and Julie. So, I'll see you for the next one. <laughs>